welcome back to Super Hostile Keizo Caverns. We are uh, at the entranceway to the next uh, dungeon. No, not the next dungeon, the next intersection. Uh, I've already been through here though, I cleared it out. There were just pressure plates everywhere. There's another skeleton spawner up there. Then we get up here. And we have the Estonian Battle Sign Level 4. See, I want to go towards Planar Warp. Because we can take Planar Warp. Oh, wow. We can take Planar Warp back to base. But, Planar Warp looks like it's going to be impossibly hard. But then again, I'm not about to jump down there. We'll check out this pack. Uh, and also, I upgraded my bow. It now has power four. I did not mean to do that. Uh, I meant to put two blocks down there. Oh, oh, oh. I figured that one shot with that so smack with my sign would have killed him. Knock him up and then knock him away. Or knock him off the edge. Oh hey, I see it. This one doesn't look that bad. There's like nothing even in here. We should be able to fly through this one. Who knows, maybe we'll get two pieces of wool in this episode. It's not unheard of. I've done it in previous episodes. It's a bit odd though that nothing is bad is in here. I'm saying that. Oh, that was in a spawner that I saw there. There's probably spawners all inside that dragon head, I bet you. You ready? I thought there's a chest up there too. Should be lighting all this up though. Guy on top of the thing right there. Uh, oh. There's a skeleton on top of there. Luckily, with my amazing sign, I mean, not sign, my amazing bow. And Dex didn't even have to give me this bow, I got it all by myself. Waiting for an explosion, but literally anything bad to happen. Those are all normal stone. There's a chest inside the dragon's head. Enchanted iron armor. Hmm. That's not one you see frequently. I hear pieces. I mean, it's not like it's a hassle for me to get out of this place. Let's get up here and see what this is. I mean, it obviously says what it is. Oh! Oh! That is nice. Much better than what I'm currently using. I 
and it's full. Uh, no, duration. Duration. Durability. That's the word I wanted. One shot. One. Where are you guys even flying? Over there in the obsidian, huh? Ow, ow, ow. Here, spider. Oh, he's above me. Hey, spider! The witch isn't gonna die in the lava, by the way. I tested witches in lava. Where are you guys coming from? One to be in here or not? There, now can I just look at the chest? See, there's not even anything in here, guys. You would have just let me look in the chest. Could have been in and out without an issue. I bet you there's something in his eye too. Hey zombie. How are you doing? Uh, I don't see how Hokey Pokey hasn't won this map already. I mean, I'm single-handedly taking out most every single thing without any issues whatsoever. I mean, we've got our iron block, we've got our gold block, we've got a bunch of other things. Why is this block off like that? At the planar warp. We know what the planar warp is going to be like because we already were at the planar warp earlier, a long time ago, in a galaxy far, far away. We weren't doing too badly. I mean, we were just getting overwhelmed by the amount of zombies that were spawning. But I mean, that's not unheard of. <laughs> look, look, look at the last episode. Not the last one, but the one before it. Ah. Gotta go down. Gotta go deeper. For whatever the achievement is. Maybe it would just be easier to go at it from the other side. Oh. Good thing that wasn't a hole. I also have to go do my, finish my laundry at some point, too. Preferably before I go to work. Oh, wait, I should be using my stone pick. That's why I brought it after all. Is there ever going to be a way down? Probably not. Up those and nothing spawns in a staircase. Happened before. Oh, hey, look at we made it. And still don't really have much to uh, speak of. Should 
problem is if I fall down, which would be much easier than staircasing down, then I'm going to get stuck down there and die. Because that's how these things work. I know how a Vex map works. And it works where no matter what I do, I'm going to die. These maps are specifically designed to kill you. Luckily, I'm, I'm trained in the ways of Vexian fighting styles, or whatever you would say. Oh, hey, look skeletons. I one-shot you guys. Or I have four. We should probably have brought Paladin, the Paladin Blade with us. Why did you even blow up? You weren't close enough to me. <sighs> this is going to be one of those ones where we make very little progress and I don't really have that long to record because like I said I have to get my laundry and go to work not all of us can just sit around and play minecraft all day oh I typically do anyway oh hey look and knock them away with the sign. You could be using that higher up the sign. But I know that the nether is going to be extremely difficult. Or at least it's safe to assume that it will be. Because it's back. But I mean we're making headway here. Where we're going, who knows? I don't. That's for sure. But then again, when do I ever know what I'm doing? It's good that I can just sort of ramble on and on and just, you know, talk about really nothing, while at the same time keeping up conversation with myself. I mean, some people find it hard. Where are you? Oh. 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 oh, blow up. You can blow up as long as there's no no guys nearby. No silverfish. I'll just funnel the zombies again. to come up with that. I purposely found lava here. You would walk into the lava. What do you guys do? No. You gotta find the safe. Take the ability to just punch the keepers backwards. Like forever. I'm still not even sure where I'm going. All I know is that this place is getting lit up, and that is progress enough for me. So we'll call the episode there. No, not really. Whatever happened to that creeper? Did he die? Probably right behind me. No. There was a, a skeleton. No, not a skeleton, but there was a skeleton. It's fast. Oh my god, a diamond helmet. Where are we going? Where, where's the box? I don't see it yet. I can't tell if I should be going up or down. 
There's another chest. Obviously, chests are nice. Hey, okay, how you doing? Oh no, the carrot! I like there's the fire too. Because the fire also is helping to light up all the areas. with more arrows. Wow, the zombie is just looting all of my shots. Good creeper, you can die. The only problem I have with places like this is I never know if I'm actually going in the right direction or not. Our armor is doing well. That's all that really matters. Okay, that didn't work. There's a lot of them over there. Oh, hey, look. Witch. Ah. Oh, you jerk. I don't even know where you Oh, jeez. How'd you get over there? I cannot. Witches are probably the worst mob there is. Oh my god, does this poison ever go away? <laughs> Basically, a witch can just kill me at any moment. How do witches even kill you? Do they throw instant harm potions on you? Oh, hey, look, a spider. Bye, spider. Nobody likes you. What don't we need here? Do we don't need the wool. Oh, hey, how you doing? I don't need. I don't even know anymore. We're gonna end up getting this piece of wool. Are you getting shot at? Where are you? Oh, there you are. Goodbye. Apparently we need to go over this way and light this up. Punch the slime in the face. Ooh, there's a chest with a sand block on it. So clearly, we're going in a direction that is a good direction. Alright, back this way. Wait, as long as we keep lighting the place up, that is in these types of maps. Very good progress. The ability to have life and safety in these maps is key to survival. I mean, but really that's good for any, any type of Minecraft. Just don't go into the darkness. I saw you coming for me. There's a witch all the way over there. Now she's dead. Oh jeez. That is not good. I knew I heard him behind me too. Ow. 
low. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Where the heck did you come from? No, no. Get away from me. Oh, come on. They're everywhere. Now they're done. What? No, I blocked you off. You can't get me now. Oh. Alrighty. Where the pathway is back to our house or the tree monument, whatever. Black wolf. What can we get rid of? I think we can get rid of. Four pieces of cobblestone. Let's do our bases further down. Just because it only makes sense. By only makes sense, I mean it just keeps going further and further down this cave. There's only one path. Oh! Why you blow up? Sometime, I will figure out how to get back to base from here. We can do it. Need to figure out where we are and where base is. Cause I have no clue. Got a little bit of time here. We can make some sticks. Make a ton more torches. That's the whole reason I brought all of these pieces of wood with me. That I can make torches. I'm not looking at you. <laughs> it sounds like you like, okay. Okay, I understand you don't want to fight. I have another chest. Like I said, I'm fairly positive that we are heading in the right direction. Where's our... Sorry, Mr. Enderman. You're getting in the way, though. I may have to just kill you. Kill you. Oh, now he's down there. He's trying to show me the path out. That is not what I meant. There's a bunch of creepers, a zombie, nothing I can't handle. I mean, if I had a companion to play this with, I bet you I'd be done by now. Granted, my already low source of food would be even lower because I'd have to be feeding on the second person. I'm pretty sure we are heading too far down now. Mm. 
Mm. Pretty sure we were not this far down. We were trying to get to our base. And we were, we were at our base. Ow! Did he drop any gold? No. Yeah, we were too far though. Too far down, I mean. Whatever. How did, where did, where did we just come out of? Oh, right here. We gotta head back up. I'm almost positive that we are too far down. I never saw the, uh, the, uh, smog, smoke stuff, whatever you call that. The bedrock fog. Uh... And we were back at our... Back at the uh, sky, starlight cavern, whatever it's called. Ow! Where the heck did you come from? Are you kidding me? You brought a sister over to kill me? That hurts, like a lot. Like, I mean, of all the things that I face, that one thing in particular, you know, is the only thing that, like, does massive amounts of damage. We gotta figure out where the base is. I'm sure that when we see it, when I see it, I'll know it. Oh. Speaking of it, I'm pretty sure... We made it. See, this isn't hard at all. Now, as you know, we're walking back to our base. Now is when everything is going to blow up. Literally everything. Like, the entire world. Am I sprinting? No. I just seem to start going faster. Maybe slowness finally wear it off. Wear it off. Wore off. I'm just so excited because we survived. <laughs> we're missing just a bunch of wool. Like we're missing so many pieces of wool. And I honestly have no clue where they are. No clue where to even like start looking for them. Ow. I mean, I have a sort of idea back in the, uh, cavern of the sky. There was a path that went down that had poison spiders in, like, a gravel pit type thing. I have a feeling that there might be a pe- Oop. We'll sleep in the bed at our spawn point here. It works. Um, need a carrot. And, uh, put down our new pieces of wool. So we got green wool, black wool, brown wool must be in the other one that we were looking at. That went, like, just a sheer drop down. Red wool must be in the nether. We're still missing pink. Which comes after lime green. Lime green was in the sky cavern. Cyan and purple, which are next to light gray and blue. So that would be Ilvern. Because blue was Ilvern and light gray was also Ilvern? Or was light gray twisted? Light gray might be twisted darkness. But um, either way, we made a huge amount of progress here. Pokey Pokey might as well give up. We basically just won the, the whole game right there. Doesn't even stand a chance now. And we can do this. Uh, protection. Go to the anvil. Okay, two levels. Another protection too. Let me do this. This is eight levels and we can get a protection three chest piece. 
Look at that. And then nothing can touch us. I also have a huge amount of other things here that we can also do use. Um, and then our pick maybe. Or five levels. Oh, efficiency two. Wow, that was amazing. Um, yeah. Let's see the chicken laid an egg. Oh, I did. Chicken. No. Well, as usual, thanks for watching this episode of Super Hostile Kaizo Caverns, and I'll see you around for the next one.